police custody tonight after a standoff. But what started it all? News 10 has been on top of this story since it first broke early this morning. Now we're taking a closer look at what happened in Southern Vigo County. In tonight's top story, News 10's Patsy Kelly is live in the studio with the information. Patsy, what do we know tonight? Well, Rondrell, police say it all started when a man began fighting with his son. 46-year-old Brian O'Neill pulled a shotgun on his son after an argument. He then fired one shot into the ground and another at his son. The son then called 911. The Vigo County Sheriff's Department and Indiana State Police surrounded the home. That's when O'Neill threatened to harm himself. The incident came to a head when, for some reason, O'Neill stepped out of the house. Police used that opportunity to grab and arrest him. It's a situation that could have escalated even more quickly based on witness information. What we are gathering at this time, that's our understanding is that he is a former uh, military. I, I don't know for certain what branch. Uh, however, we do know, uh, based on uh, reports from his son, that there were weapons in the house. And so the you know, officers did take that precautionary measure, uh, you know, with that information that we had at that time. There were no injuries during the standoff last night. O'Neill faces charges of criminal recklessness with a firearm and pointing a firearm. 45-year-old Michelle Houston was also arrested last night on scene. She was wanted on an outstanding OWI warrant. Police aren't saying what started the family argument as of now. A full investigation into the incident continues tonight. Rondrell. All right, thank you very much, Patsy. We'll, of course, continue to follow this story as more information is released. You can find the latest on air and online at WTHITV.com.